Hey there, what's going on? It's Lisa here, Raw Food for Kids. Just wanted to show you what I'm putting together for lunch. Just uh, got back from Whole Foods, got about five minutes before my daughter comes home from school, so I'm gonna just uh, do this real quickly for you. Um, seems like kale's in. It is. It's really good for you. Um, it's delicious. It has, I want to say it's, it's an acquired taste um, because after you start to have it a couple times, you start to really crave it. Uh, I started off not liking kale, and now I just, it's one of my favorite greens, to be honest. It's just really hearty, it just feels filling, and uh, really satisfying, and it, it's a tough green, I like that. Um, so anyways, I thought I would kind of do, um, I just had a couple random things in the house wanted to use up. I thought, uh, instead of doing, yesterday I did like a, kind of a fruity, real sweet um, kale salad, which is excellent, I'm a big fan of it. And I thought today I'd do more of like a savory and um, so basically what I'm going to do is I just had a half of a really small avocado and I thought um, it would go really nicely with almost like a guacamole. So this is something that, you know, if you really press for time, just swing by the store. You could buy some store-bought guacamole that's been fresh made in-house or put it together yourself, um, your favorite recipe. I'm just going to put a little avocado. I like to put some tomato. i got some um, jalapeno, a little green onion, some lime juice, um, a little salt, a little pepper if you want. You can put some cilantro. Just basically, I'm putting guacamole and kale together, and it's going to be awesome. So, um, anyways, I'm not going to really tell you too many measurements here because I'm just kind of... I would like a little more avocado, but because uh, this is a really teeny half of avocado, but you just want to taste basically just mash up your avocado. You could dice it up. It's guacamole here. I have to do, like, one of my favorite recipes, but... Um, it's going to be a real low-fat one here because we don't have much much uh, avocado going on. But I did one green onion. I uh, got about a tablespoon of some jalapeno finely chopped. You could use finely chopped red onions, nice. Pretty colored, too. Just got one small tomato. And um, I'm going to put in some a pinch of salt in here. And then I'm going to put some uh, fresh lime juice. Squeeze that in there. And the acidity helps to kind of break down the kale, too. And I'm sure you've heard it a million times from just about anybody that makes a kale salad is you want to kind of massage it into the kale. You don't have to, but it's a really nice technique. You're basically just putting your hands and just rubbing whatever dressing or ingredients you have into the kale, working it in there. And it just helps to tenderize, it helps to break it down, shrinks the salad to about half the size. So if you're thinking, oh my god, I can't eat that much kale, are you kidding me? It'll be like half the size and it just really um, makes it tasty. So here's my real simple, more tomato, avocado guac. And I'm basically just going to put this right in with my kale. All right. Like that. And you can... Taste it. I'll taste it afterwards. See if I want more salt. I don't want more lime juice. But you see this? You just mash it all together. And basically, we just have a, uh, a guacamole kale salad. So go make yourself some guacamole. Go buy some guacamole and mix it with some kale and get your greens in and make things real simple and easy on yourself. So great lunch. And you can put together in a matter of minutes. So that's it for today. There we go. We got our guacamole kale salad. Just give it a little taste. Oh man, that's perfect. Mmm. Mmm mmm mmm. That is really good. Nice and creamy from the avocado. I like that it only had a little bit of avocado. Kind of try to keep my fats a little. Somewhat moderate, um, not overkill on any given day. But uh, anyways, um, hope you like this one. Give it a try. If you're scared of kale, do not be scared of kale. Just just hook it up like this. Just keep it real simple. You can even do salsa if you don't want guacamole. Just do kale and salsa. So anyways, take care. Remember, always eat happy foods. And uh, please subscribe to these videos if you haven't. Leave me a comment. Give me a thumbs up. Any suggestions or anything you have, I'd love to hear from you. And um, thanks so much for watching. Take care.